द स्टेट ऑफ कर्नाटका इज सेट टू एक्सपीरियंस अ स्टेट वाइड शट डाउन एज ओवर टू थाउजेंड प्रो कनाडा ग्रुप हैव कॉल्ड फॉर अ बंद ऑन फ्राइडे सेप्टेम्बर ट्वेंटी नाइन्थ दिस बंद इज टू प्रोटेस्ट अगेंस्ट द रिलीज ऑफ कॉवेरी वॉटर टू तमिलनाडु Bengaluru police has taken precautionary measures by imposing section 144 in the city which will remain in effect until Saturday at 12 am. This restriction comes into place starting 12 am on Friday as announced by police commissioner B Dayanand. He emphasized that the bandh will not be allowed in the city with section 144 being enforced. Despite the call for the bandh, essential services such as hospitals, medical stores, ambulances and milk shops will continue to operate as usual. Bengaluru's Deputy Commissioner Dayananda K.A. declares a city-wide holiday for all schools and colleges. Meanwhile, the associated managements of schools in Karnataka extend moral support for the Karnataka bandh, urging district deputy commissioners to assess the situation and determine school holidays prioritizing student safety. Grocery and other non-essential shops in the state especially in the southern parts of Karnataka including Bengaluru are expected to remain shut. Flight operations at Kempagowda International Airport will continue normally but an advisory warns of potential disruptions in transport services due to the bandh. Passengers are advised to plan their travel accordingly and stay updated through airline alerts and media releases. Cab aggregators like Ola and Uber in support of the bandh expect driver participation in rallies prompting them to stay off the roads. Additionally, the Auto Rickshaw Drivers Union in Bengaluru plans to keep auto rickshaws off the roads. The Karnataka Hotel Owners Association unanimously agreed to close the operations statewide in support of the Karnataka bandh. Karnataka Film Exhibitors Association said that it will not screen any movies on Friday till 6 p.m. across the state. An official from KSRTC mentioned that there will be a reduction in the number of buses in operation on Friday. In terms of interstate operations, the official indicated that bus services to Tamil Nadu may not run on Friday. Namma Metro in Bengaluru will operate as usual and the authorities have beefed up security at the entrances. A safety inspection is being conducted the metro services between KR Puram and Garuda Chapalaya will be suspended for a full day. There will be no changes in train services on the green line.